It's not often an Australian comes to our shores and claims victory. And when they do it back to back, it really shows the quality of the driver. We feel very good about it actually. Uh, when I came over here last year, everyone told me you couldn't come over here and win it first time. And we did it last year and we've come back and done it again this year. So, yeah, very, very happy. Bates trailed early in the rally but fell into first place after an accident by one of the hometown drivers. And he says keeping his car on the road helped him secure the win. Aiden, the local guy, was uh, quicker than me initially, but then uh, he unfortunately had a crash yesterday afternoon and you know, that left us in a position to just maintain that lead today. So, so look, uh, I, I think going quickly and keeping it all neat and tidy. Bates has been driving full-time in Australia for two decades. Otago is the only rally he leaves Australia for and says our roads make the event one of his favourites. Very uh, lucky to have fantastic rally roads uh, here in New Zealand. They're just so smooth and well maintained. You know, the roads in Australia are a lot rougher. So, you know, yeah, I, I think some of the stages uh, yesterday were the highlight almost of my rallying career over 20-something years. Bates celebrated the win before packing up his truck and heading home. And after two wins on the trot, it won't be a surprise to see Bates return next year for a rare repeat. John McKenzie, 39, Deneen News.